Well, I'm back to episode 29 of the Rangers career mode, man. We're here. Too bad the league's fucking done. I bottled it, guys. I cannot deny that I did. But, as you can see, if we beat Celtic, we guarantee Hearts the league. And to be honest, that would be... It's, I mean, losing the league, shit. That that was the aim. There's no, there's no denying that here, right? But also... Us beating Celtic and making sure they don't win the league, it's a failure for both clubs, which therefore makes us look a lot better than reality. And fair play to Hearts, man, they've just been the better team. But anyway, let's do the Jambos proud and get the job done, eh? Oh, look, we're doing all the intense warm-up even though the league's done, because you guys were pish. See, for like the last past five episodes, like, I mean, it's been a fuck it, it's been a sorry mess. I think we won one game in like the last 10 games, like, <laughs> talk about fucking bottle jobs, man. It's, it's not even funny, like, it's, I mean, it's actually pathetic. Each, every game, well, I got tanked, or went 1-0 down, and then scored a late goal, you know what I mean? That, that was, that was, the, that was the memo, like, the players got. I mean, I just make the game fucking a wee bit interesting, you know what I mean? No need to win it, like, but, no, I... Which I just want to guarantee Hearts the league. I mean, even if we get beat here, Hearts can still, um, obviously still win the league. Like, I mean, they're six points clear, but at the end of the day, I'd rather guarantee it for them. And also, I'd rather beat, I want to finish second, you know what I mean? Um, I'm not sure if second, I don't think second gets you Champions League football. It might, I'm not really familiar with FIFA, but, you know, fuck it, we'll just try our best. Lovely ball through to Ryan Kent. Tripped up though by the dirty wee bastard that is known as El Mohammed. And I mean, it's just. It, it, oh, come on, mate. What are you doing? Like, is it. I don't even know. Is it him? I think I'm pretty sure it said El Mohammed. Could be fucking. I was going to say Lustig. It's no Lustig. Who is that? Ralston, is it? I don't even. Who gives a shit? Either way, he's a dirty wee bastard. Like, you know what I mean? But. Where's this ball getting whipped in? Right in there. You can't score headers in this game, but fuck it. I'll go for it. I was a corner on it. Oh, come on, man! On oh, Barisic. Come on. And he, yes, he finds Mason Mount. Good defending from Arzani. Or, what, is it even Arzani? I don't think it was. But it came up Arzani. Back to Kent. Whips it in. Alfredo! Oh, I've been a lovely finish, man. Alfredo finds Ryan Kent. Whips it back post. Ah, oh, come on. Surely. Alright, come on. You never. Why do you ever score a header on this? Like, I mean, look, every header's fucking skied. Not like last year, like, where we did it front post. It was more or less a guarantee. I mean, I, I, I like it being a bit uh, down this year, like, but at the same time, I mean, it, 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 people do score headers still, you know? It's not like it's just went extinct. Kent. Lovely ball. Number 40. <laughs> oh, number. See if, see if I change it to 14, man. Probably would have fucking scored that. Lovely turn by Mason Mount. Find Alfredo. Come on. Come on. Oh, that touch. He's been brought down, ref. How is that not a free kick? Are you taking the fucking piss? Oh, come on. Oh, I don't know. Nah. No, nah, I'm not having that, man. That's fucking. That is a fucking screw job. I mean, he gets literally poleaxed. <laughs> nice wee ball through to Ryan Jack. Finds Ryan Kent. Come on. Fucking penalty. It's about time we got a decision, guys. Like, I mean, Jesus fucking Christ. I, re I honestly don't get how we didn't get that free kick like five minutes ago, man. But I'll take S every day of the week. Alfredo oh, stepping up, we're going top fucking bins, mate. There we go, Alfredo, 1-0, and that is what I'm talking about. Finally, The Rock has come back. Jesus Christ, good ball over to Arzani. Barisic can't even get back, Fodderingham has to tip it over for a Celtic. Corner, Netcham stepping up, finds Arzani, leaves our field for fucking dead, whipped in, need to get rid of this, 
Ah, uh, no, we don't. I mean, fuck me. You can't score headers, but fuck yes, you'll concede them. And who even is it? Is it Lee Griffiths who's stuck out in the back of the net? I, I have no idea how that even looks like. I mean, that could be Annie. That could be your dad, for example. I mean, who is that? Find Jones. Jordan Jones, right, to make up for your pish fucking season, big man. Yes, he does. Jordan Jones finally actually does something of fucking use. It gets the winning goal. Well, it should be the winning goal, but knowing me, I'll end up bottling this like a wee shite bag, so don't get your hopes up. But, you know, it's a great play. First touch, I mean, he's just freshly on, like, so they weren't going to catch him, and he drills at home. Finally, man. Alfredo charging forward. Running it to the corner flag. And I've run out of fucking play like a donut, but, I mean, does it really matter? Because these ones are not going to have enough time. And that is the full-time whistle. Hearts of Midlovian have won the Scottish Premiership. And that is what we're all here for, right? If it wasn't going to be us, it may as well have been Hearts, you know what I mean? So fuck it. I'm on the Jambos, that's what I'm talking about. Fuck Celtic. Get it right, Runyes. That's why we're all buzzing, because Hearts have won the fucking league. Get it right, Runyes. I just looked at the group, and... Uh, even though Hearts have a superior goal difference, they haven't actually won it, which is a bit surprising, like, I mean, for some reason I worked at it that they had, but I mean, they've more or less won it, I mean, even if they get a point, they've won it, like, so I mean, I wouldn't be worrying too much, like, who, who did, well, look at that, I mean, they play Motherwell, and then on the last day of the season, they play Celtic, so, ho, ho, fuck me, Hearts need a result against Motherwell, or else it's going to be squeaky bum time, man. Here we go though, into the second last game of the season. Can we secure second place or will Celtic somehow be able to go into the final day challenging Hearts for the league title? But anyway, we're at Pataudry. It's a tough place to go, but let's just wipe them off the face of this earth, brother. Reese Nelson charge in, come on! Reese Nelson finds it to Barisic, who finds Ryan Jack. His former club does pretty shit, to be honest. Does fucking hee-haw with that. Oh my god, why have you slid in, you fucking donkey? You stupid wee splastic! I swear to Christ, like, seriously? I mean, what the fuck is this game all about? Why would I slide in there? It was clearly hitting X to clear the ball, and he just, he just goes, ah, you know what, I'll just follow my arse like I'm a fucking paraplegic. Like, I mean, seriously, I mean, what, what is this? I mean, look at this. What, what, why would I slide in there? It makes no fucking... And then Stevie May, fucking Jesus, look-alike bastard scores. Cosgrove, yes! Against this former club, Sam Cosgrove has made it 1-1. Tell you one thing, we may be losing the foe at the end of the season due to the loan and retirement, but Sam Cosgrove is going to step up to the task. And Stu I mean, Cosgrove and Stuart have been better than the foe this season, like, honestly. They've been pretty bloody good. Look at that, finds him though, drills at home. Cosgrove finds Mount. If he plays that first time, oh, it's a wee bit dodgy, but Jordan Jones, can he get a second? And that is what I'm talking about with Jordan Jones. He's just so inconsistent. Like, I mean, he could have so easily have done that against Celtic, but thank fuck he didn't. Like, but, I mean, at the same time, I mean, honestly, like, how do you miss that? Cosgrove, come on. Can he find Kent or Jones? I mean, yes, he can. can could Jones cut back? Oh, what's he doing? It was me, like, it was me spamming the analog stick like a wee mongoloid. But, uh, come on, win that. Why is he flicked up like that? Seriously? Like, what, what was that all about? <laughs> Lovely ball out to Jordan Jones, but there's literally no one up here. Like, what the fuck is Jones supposed to do? Cut in, that's what he's supposed to do. Jordan Jones! I mean, he just gets, he just gets so much pace, but yet he gets, I mean, he had him for toast and that guy just rapes his fucking shoulder and then you get no chance. Hasty charging for it. The man we sold to them whips the ball in. It's a decent ball in. And it's almost resulted in a fucking goal. And I threw it up to him. Wrong guy. Mason Mount is supposed to go to for fuck's sake. You stupid spastic fodder. And I'm like, seriously? And Ferguson almost buries us. And about fucking four million pounds of shit. Mount. Oh, just no pace. No fucking pace whatsoever. 
The full plays on Alfredo. It's literally last kick of the game. Alfredo Morales. Come on. Yes! That is what I'm talking about. Two late goals this episode. And it's three points. And we keep the chances of finishing second alive. Just, I mean, literally... I made the sob at about the 75th minute, but the ball didn't go out there until I cleared it there. And what a decision that was. And Alfredo drills it home. Fantastic, man. How many goals he got now in the Premier League? 14. No bad. Now is your full-time whistle. Now let's see if Hearts have won the league. Hopefully they have, man. Come on, Motherwell. Better know if jobbed Hearts out, like, for fuck's sake. Better know have... Uh, yes, Hearts have won the league. Celtic defeat at Hibs, which means um, we're more or less guaranteed third. Because we play Hibs next, I think. No, no, it's Motherwell play next. You know what I mean? So, uh, yeah. And Hearts play Celtic. But Hearts have won the league, which is good. But you never know what's going to happen next in this. That'll do for episode 29. Next time it will be episode 30. And, yeah, we're probably going to give the full the start. Because uh, he's retiring, like, so we'll let him go out with a bang. But anyway, till next time, peace.